All right, a little mix of stuff. So this morning had a nice meeting with the Lieutenant Governor of South Dakota and our research team from Harvard uh, in hopes to get a study off the ground using uh, basically carnivorous diets to uh, mitigate uh, diabetes. So more to come on that as we continue our talks and getting that thing uh, funded and off the ground. Uh, this is a um, clip from apparently Dr. Drew being interviewed by Jimmy Dore, the uh, political commentator, co comedian, uh, stating that, you know, perhaps maybe I should jump on the show. That, But let's just put, let's put a button on this story here. Um, but you look up Sean Baker also. Uh, I don't know if you guys would know him, but he's an orthopedic surgeon that eats only meat. And uh, he's a world-class athlete. And he is a, a repository. But you might interview him. Great information about oh, really? metabolism. Yeah. Okay. And um, so Sean Baker. He was on Rogan a couple, couple times, actually. Oh, okay. Maybe I have seen him on Rogan. Maybe I would love to. So they, they did it. Hello oh, there, Jimmy. If you're listening, I'd be happy to go and educate you on the uh, the misunderstanding around meat and how it's truly a beneficial uh, food. And then finally, our favorite um, Mr. Burns uh, uh, imitator, uh, Dr. Michael Grieger, is here uh, describing why Low carb diets are awful, and why you know you should eat more beans, perhaps. So healthy, we see it all the time on our comments. Low carb diets have a twenty two percent increase in overall mortality risk. I would absolutely love to hear Dr. Gregor's low carb takedown. You just did it. What, what? I mean, it increases all cause mortality unless you're suicidal. Like what? I mean, so any diet that tells people don't eat fruit, for example, like oh, don't eat fruit, really? Like or don't eat whole grains or don't eat legumes. I mean, any diet that says that. So Goldberg disease study, the largest study of human risk factors in history. The number one thing we can do to improve lifespan, associated with lifespan, uh, eat legumes. Number two is whole grains. Number three is fruit. Number four is reduced meat. Number five is reduced you know, sugar drinks. I mean, it doesn't even make sense. Even if it did have long-term sustainable weight loss, which is debatable at best, the goal of weight loss is not to fit into a skinnier can. The goal of weight loss is to not make it lighter for your pulp. Uh, let me know what you think about these little clips, and uh, uh, we'll talk to you soon, guys. You guys have a great one. Take care.